Hello, my knights. King Noah Gaming here, and welcome to Beaker. Now, this is like a little chemistry simulator game. And apparently, I just dropped some orange, and now I'm just gonna pour that out. Wait. Oh, this is gonna look so weird in the actual video. Uh, I'm going to mess with your minds. See, cause see, tell me how that looks. Weird, right? So anyways, we're gonna have a little bit of fun with Chrono Street because I need to do some, a video that was quick and I did not have the time to record an actual full I video, so I'm just gonna fool around with this while I can. Because I need a video for next Tuesday. I'm actually calling these videos so I have like a whole week. Like on trying to record one video a day. So like on Tuesday I'll have videos up until next Tuesday and all that. That is why I've been so successfully uploading. Let's mess around with some rust. What can I do with rust? Absolutely nothing. <laughs> okay, I probably can do something, but I don't know, so... Bloop. <laughs> Is me okay? Wait, you guys want to know something about magnesium? I'm going to teach you something about magnesium. The thing about magnesium is... It's super flammable. Just gonna come close together. You know, the thing is, this app actually works by like tilting your phone and stuff. The thing with my screen recorder is, it's gonna turn it. It's thing with my screen recorder is it actually only records what's on the screen. So all you see Well oh, but all you see is it just magically flying up in the air, which is probably gonna look really cool. <laughs> Potassium and water. Now it gets old. Oh god. It just instantly stopped black. Yo, let me add some more water. Okay, I'm just gonna try and grab a potassium. Let me, let me grab. Oh, oh. Oh, I could show you something really cool. If you do this a bunch, like it could end up happening. Just bloop, bloop, bloop. Playing with my potassium. Potassium, a good source of banana. Wait, that's the other way around, my god. Banana, a good source of potassium. There. But that's the correct phase. Look, I've shrunk the potassium. Honey, I shrunk the potassium. Whoa. Did you see that? Potassium rockets! Ah, oh, that is cool.
Uh, there's a reason chemistry is like one of my favorite subjects. Wait. Okay, so litmus text pH. So I want to see what color water would turn if I drop litmus. Would well, it be like a neutral purple? Or will it. Or will it be that nothing? Absolutely. Oh wow, purple. I made purple. Hmm. Let's take some bromine. What can I do with bromine? Bromine, bromine, bromine. I don't know. But I can do a real cool code check, I know that much. Just. Yep. Oh, gonna wanna lid for this. Okay, take some bromine. Then. Add some. Ozone. Come on, change. Okay, and coin. Should I change color? Yeah. And pay close attention to the bottom of the bromine. Change his color. I and mean, heck, the bromine has even become a pale orange. Isn't that cool? Ah, squatching out the sides out of the bottom of the test tube. <laughs> oh, and just for a good old fashioned night show, some potassium. Potassium rocket. Potassium rocket. Potassium rocket. Let me make my potassium rocket. Come on. Why damn it? Why is it walking? Come on. Gotta walk before. Gotta catch it. Just right. No. Ah, it's gone. It's gone. It's gone. Except for this little bit right there. Oh my god, it's a tiny bit of potassium. Doesn't seem like it's enough to react though. Okay. Let's try dropping in some. Well, sodium will act good for me. Oh, but. Oh, I forgot. I had chlorine in here, so. <laughs> yeah. Why isn't that. S oh, wait, I can't say it. I don't actually know the. Oh, it has like a little trail of roaming coming from it. Oh, love this. <laughs> Looks perfectly normal to me, but to you it's defying physics. Ah! Oh. Okay. Point out now. Ah, oh, that was amazing. So amazing. Okay, now if I remember the correct combination, what I can do is I can fill this with some dihydrogen monoxide, aka H2O, aka water.
This will actually be my final experience for the video because I gotta stop soon. Just add some water. Go over to the magnesium section. Is this the right one? Yes, it is. Hey, look at what I can do. Isn't that cool? One. One thing. Yeah. But you didn't know you could do this with magnesium, huh? Well, technically it's not full-on magnesium. It's really just... It's not full-on magnesium. It's uh, magnesium nitrate, magnesium sulfite. Let's see, does magnesium oxide do it? No. What about magnesium chloride? Yeah, magnesium chloride! I'm gonna be honest, the physics with some of this is a bit wonky, so now these experiments might end up like this in real life. Anyways... That's all the time I have for this episode. I will see you guys later. Bye.